Happy Wellness Wednesday. This week, I wanna focus on warning signs of Parkinson's disease. We remember Parkinson's disease from Muhammad Ali, who's the most famous person who's had it. Um, Michael J. Fox is another famous actor um, who is also um, afflicted with Parkinson's disease. I just wanna give you some warning signs. The first visible sign is a resting tremor or a shaking in the hand, foot, or leg. So you wanna make sure that you look out for that as the first obvious visual sign. Many of these signs that I'll be talking about are not signs uh, that are obvious. We want to make sure that we advocate for ourselves advocate for ourselves when we go to the doctor's office. The next thing is restless sleeping. A 2014 study showed that 33% of people who had um, REM sleep disorder um, ended up having Parkinson's. And after 14 years of having the REM sleeping disorder, 91% of those same people um, ended up with Parkinson's. So the, the numbers go up. So if you have REM sleeping disorder, it's something you wanna make sure you let your doctor know about. The third thing I wanna talk about is loss of smell. Um, researchers have not been able to explain why there's a link, but there has been a link um, associated with those who have loss of smell. And the numbers go into the 70s and 80% of people with Parkinson's disease um, complain about a loss of smell. Um, anxiety or depression, that's a big thing we know now with our mental health, but anxiety and depression is something that is linked very heavily uh, to people with um, Parkinson's disease. So that's something as, as well that you wanna make sure um, you talk to your doctor about it um, when you go and give your doctor's visit. Stiffness and gait problems. So we're not talking about arthritis, but we're talking about stiffness in your joints, or if your gait, you're shuffling, things of that nature, you're having problems getting out of a car, things of that nature, you can't keep up with people on a general walking basis, and we're not talking about obesity or some knee issues or things of that nature, then you want to look into that as well. And the last thing is what's called a soft voice. 89% of people with Parkinson's disease um, complain about having a soft voice. Remember how Muhammad Ali talked towards the end. So again, this has been Neil Davis with Neil Davis Fitness, reminding you to be the very best version of yourselves. Until next week, have a great day.